I see a lot of Katie laying around today. We're gonna go get me ice cream. So the doctor, we're gonna go in and- um, You have a softboard now! All right, you guys, good morning. It is um, Monday morning and Kate went to the urgent care last night if you didn't watch the vlog. We will let you know that she was, we thought she had strep throat. She thought for sure she had strep throat. She's had it before. I have strep throat all the time. She does get the strep throat. Uh, not all the time, but kind of more than the average bird. A little ice for her breakfast. throat. That's her breakfast. <laughs> anyway, they did a finger prick. Let's see your finger. Did a blood test and discovered that Kate has mono. Mono, I don't, I know. Mononucleosis. mononucleosis. <laughs> anyway, so <clears throat> Kate has some medicine. Apparently it's a virus and you can't, like you just have to live through it. There's nothing you can take that would make it go away fast. I feel my throat like touching. It's Ew, that's so gross. Mm -hmm. It's so swollen. So she has this, this medicine right here. It's like, it's lidocaine. She's supposed to put it on her throat on the inside and it's supposed to like numb it but she doesn't even want to touch her throat. Honey, I can do it for you. you all you do is you put it on a cotton swab and you just like around. Oh. <laughs> she had a bite of yogurt this morning. That's about it. What? Do you want to go outside? Hi, princess. Or prince. That's, that's not even Alice. That's Edward. Hi, Alice. There she is. Do you want to go outside too? Anyway, so Kate, you did, had you sleep last night well or no? No. Why? I have waking up because my nose was running and I had to cough and then I'd get sweaty and then I would have to take off all my sheets and then I'd get cold. Oh my gosh. That's terrible. No, I just feel like everything inside of me is dead. Mm-hmm. Mono's no good. You know they call it the kissing disease. Were you kissing somebody? Mono e mono. Mono e mono. Well, that Ew, means one. <laughs> Manos means hands. Oh, masa manos. See. Manos. Yeah. Manos. Yeah. It's not manos. Mono e mono. Yes, that's one and one. Mononucleosis might mono might stand for one, like one nucleus. Or I don't know. I have the paperwork upstairs. The doctor sent us away with some paperwork. One about nucleus. Mono. I don't know. I'm just making that up now. All right. Well, you can probably see a lot. Of, if you want to watch the rest of this video, you'll probably see Katie, a lot of Katie laying around today. Poor thing. I'm possibly throwing up with a caution sign over it. <laughs> possibly throwing up with a caution sign over it. <laughs> Fabulous. I really want to do that. You want to throw up? No. No, but well, if, if you... I do that, I'll be watching a video of it so I can have a little caution thing. <laughs> okay, stay tuned. You guys, this might be your lucky day. <laughs> Feel better, sweet love. Hi. All right, so Kate finally got off the couch. Poor little dude. She moved over to the chair. <laughs> Changed my shirt from, mm -hmm. from yesterday. That's good. Yeah. She hasn't taken any of her medicine. She doesn't want to swallow. That's why. Mm, and I don't need medicine. Really? I'm too good for medicine. Whoa. Hmm. My body can heal itself. Actually, it's not even. Well, the thing is, this medicine isn't even. <coughs> it's just for symptoms. It's not to actually heal you anyway. It's just to make it so things don't hurt. But yeah. you're you're tough. Yeah. Okay. All right. So I have to go run some errands. I'm taking back. The cat genie. I'm giving up on the cat genie. I'm so glad that's the case. Well, we're going to get ice cream. And I'm going to get ice cream for Katie, so she's going to get out and about. Look how my face looks, guys. Like, literally, it just, like, it's just, like, enlarged. Like, look how swollen my neck is. Ah! And, like, my eyes and my face is just big. Like, that's so Are gross. Are you going to show them your throat? No. That's gross. I think it's cool, but... <laughs> Did it get worse? Everyone else thinks it's gross, yeah. I wonder if you're on the upswing. She said, you're probably gonna get worse before you get better, do you know that? That's how it is with everything. But, unless you were already at the worst, you know? Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! All right, you guys. That was probably one of the most disgusting things I've ever, I'm sorry, I love you dearly, but oh my gosh. I don't, know how, you, I don't know how you don't think that's cool. There's pygmies growing in her 
in See, her when you put it like that. Oh my gosh. <laughs> that sounds disgusting. Well, it is. I'm gonna. <coughs> All right, we're gonna go get Mc ice cream. Make ice cream. No, we're not going to McDonald's. We're going to get ice cream. My face is oily. I have pollution on it. Ah! This is why my phone is broken. Okay, bye. All right, so we're trying to watch the car. It's raining now. And I don't want Katie to cough on me. This. Please don't cough on me. Ah! We're making the best of it. Spending time with Kate's always fun. Oh, at least she has a positive attitude, you know what I mean? Mom, I have a question. What? Um, will you please, when we go that way, will Here, you please hold that. get the charger so I can be on the ox? When we go what way? When we turn around, can you run me really fast and grab the charger cord so I can be on the ox? Wait, the, char wait, the charger cord, where is it? In my room. Oh my gosh, are you serious? Where else would it be? I do wait, can I just go in my car and get the charger card out of yeah. my car? Okay. You're gonna jam? Okay, bye. Hi. I have to sing to stuff that's gonna hurt my throat. Yeah, you can't sing. It's okay. I can't sing in general. Mom's not having too good of a time. I bought the cat Jeannie's self-flushing toilet for the cats. Yeah, see, that was your first mistake. That was a mistake. But the cats didn't use it, so I wanted so to mistake. return it. So I called today, and because I ordered it online, and they said I could return it to my local store. So I had to get this monster in the car and then get this monster in here and I took it in and um, I bought it at Petco and as I'm walking in the lady goes, welcome to PetSmart. I'm like, oh my gosh, wait a minute. This isn't even where I bought it. So we Good have one. to return it to the wrong store. Good one. So now we just trying to go to Petco. I meant to Can I get my Smoothie King first? I'm so hungry. I know you're hungry, but oh my gosh. I'm so, watch, oh, this thing is like, it, it's really cool. It works well. Oh my gosh, there's water in there. It works well, but the cats just didn't like it. Because cats don't flush toilets, Mom. Well, they didn't need to flush it. It flushed by itself, Kate. But this I am returning. This I did buy here. I'll be back. Oh my gosh, you're crazy. All right, Kate says she goes in and out of feeling yucky yucky and just feeling yucky. And right now she's yucky yucky. But we're gonna go into Robex, which is a smoothie store, a smoothie and healthy food store. So we're gonna get a good smoothie. She says she's hungry. She has an appetite, but doesn't want to eat anything, kind of. Do you want to eat? Yeah. Hmm. I'm gonna swallow this, though. Okay, just make sure it's- it be easier to get like a spoon thing rather than a straw? Oh, that's a good question. Thank you. I don't know. I don't know, let's take a look. All right, you guys, we've had some situations transpire since we last saw you. This morning I called our pediatrician because yesterday when we went, when Kitty felt sick, we went to the urgent care, um, which is like a walk-in clinic. And when they, when we left, they said, hey, you should um, you know, follow up with your pediatrician because that's your doctor, blah, 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 and they'll take care of you from here on. So we called the pediatrician and she called us back and asked a few questions and said, you know what? I'd feel much more comfortable if I see Katie. It sounds like she's getting worse rather than better, which I think she kind of is. Right now she seems to have energy, but what you missed was she slept for about an hour and a half in the car. So when oh she was gosh, a baby, my face looks so round. when she was a little baby and she would be like sleeping in her car seat, I would just keep driving around so she didn't have to wake up. Oh, and I did that again. That's so cute, you did? Yeah, we drove for like an hour and a half while you were sleeping. And we, I drove around and around. We <laughs> flew over there. Well, yeah, oh my gosh, we were everywhere. So we're at the doctor, we're gonna go in and um, see what they say. Bye. Mono day two. Mono dose. Mono dose, <laughs> exactly. Mono e dose. Right, the doctor came in and said that she gave her a once over and checked everything and said it definitely was acting like mono, but they're gonna draw blood, a vial of blood, and we'll get the blood test back tomorrow. She's gonna give her a huge dose of Motrin. So she, liquid, <coughs> liquid, because she doesn't want to swallow a pill. Oh. Cheers, mates. <laughs> yes. 600 grams of Motrin right there. Should I take this like down fast? I, I don't know, whatever's gonna be I easiest this is for your throat. Ah, oh, that really, I should start oh, grabbing myself. Oh, good luck. It looks like it tastes good. No. Oh, <laughs> not at all. Sorry. It tastes like liquid medicine. I, guys, I don't know if you know this, but I hate liquid medicine. <laughs> I would rather take a pill any day. It's up to like, me. Like, I can't, like, I can't not take, like, people are like, oh, I can't take pills. Like, I can't not take, so this is going to be impossible to get these two. Well, then you should take a pill. Why don't you take pills? Good luck. Oh, I can't do it. Do you want to pay me? All right, you guys, you know we normally go so to Chick-fil-A. So we'll be doing a poll. Oh. Based on if you want more 
Katie stays home from school days and does errands with mom <laughs> while she's dying. Well, what we didn't mention yet was thank you so much. Thank you. All right, bye. You guys, we're at Starbucks. I and wait, wait. Katie got oh, egg white bites. so tasty. Because normally after Dodger, if you watched yesterday's video, you know that we go to Chick-fil-A, or if you watch any of our videos with Brennan or Ryan, we go to Or anybody who gets sick anybody ever. Anybody who gets sick, or just go to <laughs> or, or whatever. We go to Chick-fil-A after to get Chick-fil-A, but today Katie wanted Starbucks. Okay, see the thing is, I would have had Chick-fil-A, except I'm not allowed to do physical activity or exercise because my spleen is enlarged because I have mono. And so, I'm not allowed to do physical activity or exercise for like, ha like three weeks. A long time. Yeah. Like a long time, and it's I don't want to get, I don't want to blow up and get all chunky and stuff. My <laughs> face already looks bad because my swollen lymph nodes. I'm not trying to make it like actually bad, <laughs> and so I need to be eating better. So Chick Fil A milkshake's healthy. not a good idea. So Chick Fil A milkshake every time I go to the doctor, which I'm assuming is going to be a lot, might not be the move. So okay. instead, I got an equally as fattening. Starbucks, <laughs> Starbucks drink. <laughs> Make you feel better, and then protein eggs, or egg, I mean egg white. Yeah. Oh, oh she's I, hilarious. I'm having trouble speaking. So the other thing that we should tell you is this is the last week of school. So today's Monday, and they have school Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Friday, Friday's half day, last day, half day, Tuesday, Monday. Thursday, half day, Friday. Yes, Friday's the last day. But I still have quarterlies that I haven't taken. Katie still has things she's you, but the doctor said no more school. She's done. And we kind of knew that. <laughs> Wait, I'm done. Yeah, they said that today. Oh, bet! You yeah. have a sophomore now! You didn't hear that? The doctor that we went to at the urgent care said definitely not Monday and Tuesday. So I called the guidance counselor this morning to let them know that she wouldn't be there and what should she do. And she, she assumed that Kate was going to be gone the whole week. So she emailed all the teachers to get all the information and what what she needed to do to finish up the year. So they've been sending all that stuff back in. So Kate has a few things to I'm do. I'm a good counselor. She's a great counselor. But you do have to actually go in and take the biology test. But anyway, the doctor, our real doctor today that we went to, who's our pediatrician who has been ever since Katie was born and since before Brennan was born. We love her, she's great. Yes, they're awesome. The, um, they said no more the rest of the week and um, so Katie- Yo, I'm on summer school. break now! <laughs> that is so tough, that is so Terrible tough. way to start your summer. Sorry. Early? <laughs> okay. I don't think so. But anyway, the last thing is, and this is like the longest video ever, and it's only three o'clock, four o'clock. Um, the other thing that we should tell you is, by the time you've seen this video, you've already seen um, ordering with the people, eating with the people in front of us ordered. Well, we did that video. Okay, go watch that video, by the way. If you haven't watched it, go watch it. It's excellent. That's good. It's so fun. But, let me finish this, because I realized it, and I was like, oh my gosh, <laughs> guess what, mom? And then she was like, what? And then she started crying. <laughs> so basically, we did the challenge where, <clears throat> you order what the people in front of you order in line for a drive through drive restaurant. restaurant thing, fast food place. So we did that. And it was the, me, Mom, Brendan, and Ryan. So the four of us together all tried all of the food that the person in front of us got. So like at Starbucks, they all, we got two drinks because that's what the person in front of us ordered. And we all drank out of the two drinks. Well, can you see what's happening here? If you put two and two together, mono is spread by the sharing of saliva. So we all drank out of the same Baja Blast from Taco Bell. We all ate off the same cr Crunch Wrap Supreme. Yeah. Like, <laughs> yeah. Oh no. Yeah, so they're Sorry. all done for. And then I blew out Ryan's birthday candles. <laughs> on his, <laughs> on his, on his cupcakes, cupcakes yesterday. And I literally, and it's like, yeah. It was bad. So stay tuned and to see if the whole family okay. gets mono. In addition, I'm really, like me and my friends, me and my close friends are so close. Like me and Molly and Natalie, like I like take gum out of Natalie's mouth if I'm trying to get too busy gum. Uh. It's just super, it's just funny and dumb stuff that we do. And so yesterday I was with Molly and Natalie and we were at Molly's house and I was in her kitchen just like scrab scavenging for food because I was hungry. I ended up getting some carrots, so I'm not like completely like <laughs> fat, but I, there was like a little scone, like a blueberry scone on the counter and I was like, Oh, this looks like it's Max. So I like cut off a piece and brought it back to the room, and they were both sitting there watching Netflix. And Natalie was like, "Let me have a bite." I was like, "All right." So I literally bit off the skin, and then she had the rest of it. Oh no! And, and then shared a juice box. And then I got a juice. I got a Capri Sun. Came back in, and then I drank. It, and me and Natalie shared it. And then. I was I felt bad for eating the scone because it was unhealthy, so I decided to get <laughs> to get carrots. So I got carrots, and then I would double dip with my carrots. Back. Oh no! And then in addition to that, 
I was still feeling unhealthy, so Molly had a naked, and that's why I shared the naked with Molly. Oh my god. And they keep texting me. They're like, I don't feel good. I'm like, yes, you're oh, fine. Oh no. You're fine. Seriously? Yeah. This is just terrible. Everybody, they tell you when you're a little kid to not share food, and it's true. Do not share your food. No. Do not share no. Things. No. You know what? <laughs> share your food. Live your life. Oh my gosh. And get mono. Gain that immunization from Mario. Have it once. Never get it again. That's what they said about measles. You only again. you only live once, and you might as well you have experience mono. mono. <laughs> okay, great. You see her now. The next thing she's gonna be next like, up, I'm gonna be like <laughs> <laughs> complaining like she was earlier. Dude, today. I go up and down all day. I've been so so up and down. These yeah. snacks though, they're really good. Mom, bye. No, no, I don't. <laughs> oh, hey, you okay? Rosie Katie, twenty one, two. Oh jeez. Ryan, you know what we realized today? When we were in the car doing the challenge, we all drank out of the same cup as Katie. Twice. Dun, 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 dun. I'm mono. You might. You just don't know it yet. All of Shoot, us might. Actually? Maybe. Katie, does it hurt? <laughs> Did she answer you? Katie, did you hear what Ryan said? What? Does it hurt? What? Mono. Yeah. Oh. Honest? <laughs> Come on. Our whole family's gonna have a mono. Oh, I know, except dad. He wasn't in the challenge. Yeah. Lucky him, that was smart. Hey, how was golf? You had practice tonight. Good. Very I'm good. Eagle. You had an eagle? Are you serious? Are you serious? All right, you guys, do you know what an eagle is? An eagle is two under par. So if, it, if there's like a, let's say, what, what, what hole is it? What was the par on the hole? Par four. Are you serious? Par four, which means generally a professional should be able to get from, get the ball in the hole in four strokes. Ryan, who is a semi-professional, got it in two strokes. So a birdie is if you got it in three, which is one under, and an eagle is two under. Are you serious? Seriously, on a par four, Tell me what happened. That's so, ridiculous. Whipped my drive like insane. A little bit on the right side. We're so good though. We're playing the green. It's pretty flat. It's got a little bit of a right to left break. Not as much though. Uh, more right than left. Take my uh, take my wedge. We're about like 53 yards out. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Plays it front edge. Trickles down, uh, breaks a little bit, a little bit more, bam. No way. Are you, that was that luck or was it skill? What do you think? Like this, drop my club with, oh, wait, wait, no. Oh, you allowed to do that? <laughs> a little side of celebration. And I just some grass. And then everyone rushed over to me and I was like, yeah. <laughs> was Coach Todd there to see it? No. That is awesome. Coach Stu? Because we're going to the next hole. I drove by him because he was in another group. Uh -huh. And I was like, Todd, Eagle. And he's like, I don't believe it. He goes, Wait, did he actually? And um, Colin was there because, yes, yeah, service hours. Great. Uh, uh, as like a kind of a coach, Colin's Brennan's friend was a seven, uh, 17 under. So uh, he goes, Colin, did he actually? And he's like, Yeah. <laughs> so my Eagle ball is in, the, is in my case. <laughs> nice work. So in the past month, you've gotten three birdies and an Eagle. Is that right? That's amazing. Congratulations. All right. All right, you guys, it's late, late, late at night. Brennan and Ryan already went to sleep. How are you feeling now, Katie? Wait. Mmm, tired. Are you? You think you'll sleep well? Hopefully. I hope you do too. She took some more Motrin. Or I'm gonna wake up and shower tomorrow. That's and a good then idea. I'm gonna finish my science project. Okay. And we'll get your blood results back tomorrow. You'll be able to tell us how long you've had this and basically how much longer it's going to be and what to expect and all that stuff. Ew. <laughs> Did anything make you happy today? Corey. Yes. Katie's friend Corey came over and they finished their science project. She's going to try to go into school tomorrow and present it. We'll see how that goes. I can't let Corey do it by herself. That's very kind. I'm gonna just con I'm communicate with your um, guidance counselor and make sure that's kosher. No one's gonna even know that I'm there. 
Well, your science teacher will, and everybody in your science class, and everybody knows you have mono. It's like Save Ferris at high school. Everybody was texting Katie. They're passing around cans. We just watched Ferris Bueller's Day Off, like, literally two days ago. Passing around the cans, collecting money for Katie. Mike, wear, Dad wears a t-shirt, save Katie. All right, well, what made me happy today was, let me think, oh my gosh. Well, I have to say, Ryan getting an eagle. That's pretty awesome, that makes me very happy because I know he's pretty proud of that. Maybe happy to see Katie um, smiling even though we were at the doctor and she was not feeling well. Actually, it made me happy that the sun came out after it rained this morning too, that was nice. So Brennan and Ryan and Dad are all sleeping, so I know they had great days, but please share what made you guys happy today. Thank you so much for watching. Tune in tomorrow to see Mono Day 3. How Mono treats Katie on Day 3. Oh, buddy. Oh, hey, Katie. All right, you guys. Comment below what made you guys happy today. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Thanks for watching. Be sure to thumbs up and subscribe. See you later.